In Asia, ethnic Rohingya, Muslims from Burma, have been fleeing in ever-increasing numbers in response to violence by the country's Buddhist population. They, at some point in time, hundreds of years ago, perhaps in some cases, you know, migrated um, into, into Burma and have never been accepted, basically, as nationals of Burma. Undereducated, poorly educated, Rakhine young men uh, who resort to violence quite easily. And they were very often the trigger for localized violence in the Rakhine state against the Rohingya. But it's propelled by hate speech. And a lot of that comes from the, the radical nationalist monks. As many as one in 10 of the roughly one million Rohingya have fled the country on boats. It's always something very local, like a fight breaks out between a couple of people and it suddenly ignites. And in the Rakhine state, which is one of the poorest areas of the country, you have a very large unemployed youth population. The reality is that there have been tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of Rohingya that have fled into Bangladesh, living in makeshift camps, unofficial camps, you know, living on the margins of Bangladeshi society, which is really, when you're talking about margins, that, that's really quite, quite marginal. 